My name's Neil Siki. I'm one of the cardiologists with the Swedish Cardiology Group. My offices are in Edmonds and Mill Creek. Today you're watching Swedish news you can use and we'll be talking about high blood pressure. Having high blood pressure puts excess strain on the heart and increases your risk of having a stroke or a heart attack. Unfortunately, high blood pressure has no symptoms and really the only way to know what your blood pressure is is to check it yourself at home or to have a doctor or nurse check it for you. It's important that everyone does get checked for high blood pressure at least once a year with your primary care physician, especially starting after age 50. So the biggest risk factor for high blood pressure is age. Uh, nearly everyone will have high blood pressure by the time they're 75. Uh, many people will start earlier. When we measure blood pressure, we measure two numbers, the systolic and the diastolic. The systolic is the top number, and that's the peak pressure that the heart produces and the body's exposed to. The diastolic is the lower number, and that's sort of the maintenance pressure that helps to drive the blood to the organs such as the brain and the kidney. To avoid developing high blood pressure, or to bring a slightly elevated blood pressure back to normal range, I recommend that you maintain a healthy weight, eat a diet low in sodium, get plenty of sleep, and avoid excess alcohol or cigarettes. If you're getting readings that are consistently greater than 140 over 90, you should let your primary care provider know. I'm Dr. Siki with Swedish Cardiology Group here in Edmonds, and you've been watching News You Can Use.